Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is July um, 24th. <laughs> it is a Monday. It's the second to last Monday of July, which means it's the second to last Christmas ornament for the Deck to Halls collab. Now, last time I was wearing a Christmas shirt, but you can't see it <laughs> at my angles, but I am wearing a Santa shirt. <laughs> you just can't see it. But anyways, I'm filming in my bedroom today because the, uh, the whole the rest of the family is in the living room. And I didn't want to disturb them or make them be quiet. <laughs> anyways. So, okay, Kim and Terry, if you're watching this, I had to make a separate ornament than the one I sent you because the one I sent you turned out really big. It was more like an amigurumi. <laughs> so I, um, I said, uh, no, thank you because that would like break my Christmas tree. So I did find another one. But if I can think about it before I put this video out, I will message you and tell you that. <laughs> but anyways, this collaboration is called Deck the Halls. I'm doing it with Terry from Yarn Drum Podcast and Kim the Crafty Nomad and a bunch of other people have since joined in as well. And we're sharing every Monday through July a Christmas ornament so that you can make them up between now and actual Christmas season to gift to your friends or to put on your own tree or whatever. So my ornament this um, week, and I don't forget the name of it. <laughs> I think it's just called Christmas Ornament. I think that's what it says. It's by Sylvia Carmen Comescu. I think it's how you say it. I'm, I'll probably pronounce it wrong. But it's free pattern. It's PDF download. And it does have a crocheted bow on it, but I had a hard time understanding the written part of that so I just decided not to do the bow <laughs> but um here's mine <laughs> I used some blue and white the white is red heart the blue I'm not sure what it is it doesn't have a ball band and then I that one is clear but shimmery I just hot glued some snowflakes on there because I like snowflakes so I put those on there I had some other Christmas buttons these are buttons by the way <laughs> from Hobby Lobby uh but they're really small so I didn't want to have to put a bunch of them on there Oops, so I went with snowflakes, and I think it's cute. I like the blue and white together, and then the snowflakes. It's just pretty. I like them a lot. And I did just knot my ends and cut them off <laughs> because it's going to go on my tree, so I, I'm not worried about there being an end on there. But it's really quick and easy pattern. I, it's worse than my yarns, and I believe I used an e-hook. It calls for smaller yarn and smaller hook, but uh, like I always say, I'm a worse to weight person, so I... Um, I just did what I wanted to do. <laughs> so it's just a few rounds of half double crochets and then you do some slip stitch around this to make it look like a border. And the slip stitch goes into the chain to make the hook. And I probably, sh I, I did what she said <laughs> in the pattern, but I wish I had made that bigger because I don't know if that's gonna fit good on my tree. <laughs> but I think it's cute. And that one snowflake will definitely catch the lots and it'll be pretty. <laughs> But that's the ornament for this week. Super quick and easy. Yep, I, you know, I made it in just a few minutes. <laughs> the longest part was waiting for the hot glue gun to heat up <laughs> to glue the buttons on there. But, uh, yeah, I like it a lot. So I'll leave it linked down below if you want to check it out. The baby's crying at her. <laughs> uh, and then come back next Monday for the last Deck the Halls collab. That's for this year. Maybe we'll do it again next year. <laughs> but um, I like this a lot. Yeah, I really like that one. I'm watching it shimmer in the video. But, uh, yeah, I just put a little bit of hot glue in there, and it wasn't even enough to, like, go through. But they're stuck on there good. I mean, I'm sure if you just yanked them, they would come off, but I'm not planning on doing that. <laughs> and we will have our Christmas tree blocked off again this year, because June is handsy. But maybe next year she can <laughs> touch the tree without ripping everything off. But, yeah, like I said, I'll leave this link below, along with Kim and Terry. And the collaboration video will all be linked in the description box below. So check it out and watch all their videos. And we'll be getting ready for the last one. It makes me kind of sad. But oh well. It's been a good run. <laughs> I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.